As vaccinations rise, new cases of COVID-19 continue to decline. And tonight, St. Mark's Hospital is hitting a positive milestone in the pandemic that doctors and nurses thought might never arrive. New specialist Jed Bull joins us live with the story. Jed, we all kind of cheered when we heard this. Yeah, exactly, Dini. For the first time in more than four months, uh, I'm sorry, more than 14 months, 431 days, the doctors and nurses at St. Mark's Hospital are not treating any patients with COVID-19. There are still 136 people hospitalized with COVID statewide, but that's down from the peak in December, and St. Mark's is free of COVID patients. ICU doctors and nurses we spoke with emphasize that the pandemic is not over, but this is a hopeful phase. They say treating COVID patients was unlike anything they've ever done, and there were many dark days. Dr. Jared Johnston leads the team in the ICU and says they felt overwhelmed for several months on end. When a patient went on a ventilator, he was the doctor who intubated them. He was also too often the last person that the patient spoke with before they died. Now he feels as though the hospital has turned a corner. We've turned a corner in that COVID is now um, just another thing we take care of and that we're learning about. Um, but yeah, it's under, it's under much better control. To see yesterday that we actually went down to zero for the first time in over a year, um, it was a pretty good feeling. I, I won't lie. It felt nice to just know that we could kind of breathe for a second. Again, they know that it's not over, but they now believe that they can handle whatever influx of COVID patients may arrive. Coming up at six.